Okay, friends. So now we are going to discuss about the Bob suit that how you can find the lot of subdomains uh, with the help of Bob suit. And also I will show you the best way to uh, find out the any any of the subdomains of any uh, website using Google Doc. So firstly, let me uh, let's decide one of the you can say let's view my okay let's say Paytm. Paytm have a lot of uh, domains, so let me open the Paytm.com. Okay, so this is the Paytm.com, and what I'm going to do with Bob Suit that so that the target is automatically is coming right you can see here it is auto automatically capturing those requests but here uh, you need to go in the scope and if you can see here here is a button so just click on that advanced click on add and in the host or IP range what you need to give that dot star backslash dot and let's say paytm.com because you need only this domain right so okay sorry uh, paytm and then again back dot com and the sign of dollar so in spite of if you don't want that that dot com then you can just uh, uh, click on the double dot that's it so but i need so i so now what what is going with that that uh, the domains with having paytm.com uh, it is going to show me let me uh, show you that how it is showing right so the target is sitemap so you can see here okay so I have opened or not let me check it again uh, paytm.com okay great and in the scope i need only show only in scope item supply right so now you can see here uh, i'm just able to uh, check out the only paytm.com now you can think that uh, this is very less sub subdomains right so here is a trick that what you need to do you need to visit wh wherever you want to go in this paytm website so wherever you want to find where you want to find uh, uh, the you can say the bug let's say you want to find the uh, subdomains of carrier one so just go in the carry one and explore uh, explore these things whatever you want to do just explore all these things click each and everywhere wherever you think that yeah there might be some subdomains right so whatever let's say explore jobs even and let's say even let's say sh share so each and everything whatever you want to do just click there and once you will click the, all those things you will get to know that yeah there is lot of things which is already captured by the bob suit right so in the http section if you will go you can see here there is lot of things which is regarding the paytm so these are the subdomains of paytm.com this all are this uh, here it, it is the Firefox one which is already coming before uh, we set the paytm.com but after that you can see here all those are related to paytm.com now what else you can do you can just go there and you can just right click and you can also find the subdomains of subdomains so I'm just again scanning this crawling this okay so you can see this is the subdomains it will find the subdomains of subdomains if it is available so see here it has been started the first one we got it sig.com so if if it is has something then definitely it is going to show us i think there was not much one that's why it, it has been stopped okay so let's say another one so scan whatever you want to scan just scan it in this way you will able to find all the domains all the things uh, wherever you you want to uh do the or you can say uh, find the bugs so this is the best way okay so and you and also the main thing is that you can also intercept is uh, there is off and you can again reload this okay so let's let's uh, uh, ptm.com only right so here is the trick so forward okay so right click scan crawl and audit so
so here is it is happening now you can go again in the proxy settings forward 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 right and again there is ptm dot again you can scan so whatever is uh, you want to scan you can just scan here uh, that will be good So in the dashboard, if you can see that paytm.com scrolling is, is still going on. Uh, 257 requests, 260 requests. Uh, request. So it's, it's still going on. So in the proxy and the HTTP requests, here it is the, your subdomains. How many subdomains you can see here? So let's say, let's say, uh, do this one as well. Intercept is off. Again on. Click here. And scan. Crawl. Right. So now it will again start it for the ptm.com. Okay, just apply this. Now we have Cloudflare one as well, but we don't know. We don't want those things, so we need only show in the scope items. But here in the scope, once you will go in the proxy settings in the HTTP history, these are the your subdomains which is uh, going on. So this is one of the way. Uh, it's it will take a lot of time, right? So I'm not going to do the, those things because uh, it is going to take that much time. So now I'm moving towards the OKL. Meanwhile, uh, let me show you with the help of uh, uh, Google Doc, do Google Doc what you can do. Okay, so let's uh, decide one of the website. Let's say Puma.com. We have already done the Paytm one. So site colon, uh, let's say Puma.com. And you want to minus www.puma.com you want some other domains right so now you can see directly here is the pumatric.puma.com you can you can just check out those things what it is exactly so this is the very the very shortest uh, thing that how you can do these things and one of the best way i can say because it directly will uh, tell you that what what is the subdomains they are uh, is happening with the help of that one and you can directly try to find out the bug there and it will also increase the range and uh, the probability of finding the bug correct so this is how we can do you can check here they see a uh, gift card dot puma dot com i don't think uh, you will you guys give will see uh, anywhere else right so you can do whatever you want to do here if you find anything then you can report to puma here it is uh, there are a lot of things right so this is the website of br brazil okay cl okay different different websites for different companies this is for australia now uh, this is for New Zealand, right? So this is how it works, guys. I hope. Uh, okay, so this one is still going on, and we have that much domains, uh, subdomains, in the target section, in the dashboard, in the site map. Let's see. So these are the things you can check out. These things. So that's it guys and I have already told you the shortest way to find out those things. Okay, let's say uh, ptm.com which is the same thing I dot com and hyphen means minus. So I want to minus I don't want to see this result www.ptm.com right. So I don't want to see that that one result uh, www.ptm.com so you can see now the ptm.com is how it is coming ads.ptm.com it will come with different different uh, subdomains 
so with the help of google doc you can do lot of things that's it guys in this video bye bye take care